guys, the Rex 6 Survival, here another YouTube video. And today I am with the pig, and we are comparing my survival pack to his survival pack. And uh, yeah, so you guys know I've been doing mine for like a year and a half. And the piggy has only Yeah, he's only been doing his for like a couple of weeks. Years. So uh, weeks. he has a Jan Sport backpack, they're really good, have a lot of pockets. Uh, pig, show him what's in there, your first pocket right there. Um, in my first pocket, I have my medical supplies. I have a band-aid, um, some alcohol wipes. And now, he doesn't have a lot in here, but for one person, one, you know, uh, cut or something like that, this is probably just enough for him. I'm probably so. going to get some more bandages over the years. Get some more stuff. Yeah, he's definitely going to get more stuff. But like I said, he just started a few weeks ago, because so he doesn't have a lot. Because if I would cut myself once, I doubt it in this survival situation. Alright, we'll put that away and uh, show us what's in your next pocket. In my next pocket, I have my food supplies. Alright. I have my water bottle for water. I have some Cheerios that do not go bad. And I have this makeshift, um, what is it called? MRE. Uh, so, right here is something that one person, this can probably last you like two meals out of your day. Right here, we have these, and he said they don't go bad. I mean, they do. They do get really stale, but I don't think they ever start getting mold on them or anything. They do not. These are, like, a few years old, I think, and they still taste the same way. They're pretty much Cheerios with no sugar on them. That's pretty much all they are. They're good. And, uh, yeah, that will last you a meal, so that guy, that's, that's good. See right there, 100 calories. Right here, water, and uh, water is very important, you know, uh, without water in a survival situation, you cannot survive. You'll be you can have as much food as you want, but without water, nothing ties in. So, water, very important, and there's never enough water, like I said. Like I say in other videos and everything, there's never enough water. Eddie, what are you saying about this uh, MRE thing? Want to open it up? Sure. I have a granola bar, if I could get it out. Again, may not look like much, but for one person, this is enough. You got a Nature Valley bar, you know, just for that snack on the trail. And right over here, we have some tea packets. One of these things are some strong um, sugar, so yeah. we take on two packs. We got sugar, and everybody knows that just drinking non-stop water, you know, you could be a water guzzler, but it's, you know, it gets yeah, boring. You After drinking all that water. It up. Yeah, so, you know, having sugar water or just even tea will raise your morale out on the trail, or if you're camping, or just in a survival situation. Uh, yeah. So, let's show us what you have in the next one. Put all that crap away. Oh, and uh, you guys know my survival pack. Got my medic stuff right here. I have an MRE in here. I have fire making stuff in here. You guys can't see that. Yeah, I got fire making stuff in there. And then I just have my random stuff in here. Then I got the big stuff. And in my next pocket, this is my last pocket. And all I have is a light source in case I'm like in the dark. I have my flashlight from the Dollar General and it works right. if you can so, see it. So he has a flashlight and you know light is very important uh, when you're out there if you're hiking and you know it's getting a little dark out or you're just in a dark space and looking at something uh, maybe like you know a little groundhog hole or something like that you never know you never know what you're looking into but you know, having a light source is very important. And, uh, yeah. So, that was the comparison to the pig's backpack to my backpack. Mine obviously has more stuff in it and may be bigger. But his has a lot of pockets and he does, he, he does have some pretty good stuff in there. So, uh, yeah. We will see you guys in the next video. Go check out Glock45XL and Cowboy 2 and uh yeah, bye guys.